Tidings to you, cockroach. I take a particular interest in your blood bath, of which has occurred within the last six hours. Of the many fallen souls to have been struck by your own apathy, my hypervigilant yet merciful blood relative and the elderly woman separated from my location of rest were but two of them. However, nearly the entirety of the population within our current residence has been eradicated, which I indeed accentuate is a quandary of utmost importance. With this in mind, I begin this brutal Brannigan with a brief interrogation. I ask you to think about the potential, tiny as it may appear, for one who has been consumed by sin and the reverence to overcome this and exhibit behavior that warrants them a chance of cleansing. A mere opportunity for purity and redemption. Do you feel that it is a thought that is conceivable and realistic? I pity and scoff at your lack of intelligence as you did not provide an answer worthy of your progression to my next series of thoughts. Rather you appear to be fixated on donating copious amounts of agony to me. Though what you failed to consider is that this objective is a topic of interest for my next query. I, the cartilaginous framework, whose name is derived from Vincent Canaire's easy to read yet frequently ridiculed sans serif casual script typeface, have grown quite tired over your bellicose attitude and equally sinful body count and thus invite you to a series of unfortunate events. However, if you are unwilling to bear witness to this dwindling of your days, I suggest you concede defeat now and forfeit your life support to our crowned king. Otherwise I warn you that upon gallivanting forwards once more, the amount of displeasure you will face will be quite large. I must offer my sincerest apologies to the aforementioned elderly lady behind the grand entrance in the forest, as I have failed once more to live up to my vows. Nonetheless I shall do what is right to avenge you and honor your legacy of stand-up comedy. I am quite drawn to the current weather, which is oddly and obscenely a polar opposite to the grim scenario bestowed upon us currently. There is a harmonious song being delivered by the many birds in the sky, and the beams of the sun allow for the harvest of the king's garden. Unfortunately I cannot say you will get to experience the beauty of life because of the amount of it that you have taken from us all. Rather, I advise that you will soon be visiting the deepest bowels of the devil's vicinity. Good riddance. Hey! Ah! 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 Ah!